The Hat Tricks got a big win on Friday night in Binghamton to lengthen the gap between the Hat Tricks in third place and the Thunderbirds in fourth, the Black Bears in fifth, and the Black Bears come to town tonight in Danbury for the second of a three game series. Hat Tricks 33, 20 and three, the Black Bears from Binghamton 29, 24 and two. Glad you could join us on Hat Tricks YouTube tonight. And the Hat Tricks look to keep their dominance on at on home ice and play the Black Bears tonight. It was a 5-3 win last night, close in the end, but the Hat Tricks got a empty net goal late to seal the win. Starting for the Hat Tricks in goal is Brian Wilson tonight. 10-4-0, 296 goals against and an 899 save percentage. We will step aside as they do the national anthem and we'll be right back with the puck drop coming up next on Hattrick's YouTube. about ready for puck drop in Danbury. The Hat Tricks and the Black Bears tonight. Starting for the Hat Tricks. Uh, starting lineup presented by PR Electric. It is the top line tonight. Johnny Ruiz centering Dustin Gesso. Two goals last night for Gesso and Nick Mangone. He has been in the lineup for a few games for the Hat Tricks now and gets the start tonight. On the back end, it is Aaron Atwell and Brandon Pepe, and in goal again, Brian Wilson for the hat tricks for Binghamton. Gino D'Angelo on the left wing, Josh Newberg at center, and Sam Turner on the right wing. In defense is Matthew Boilar and Tyler Pekarski. In goal, Joe Shepard, who is 9 6 and 1, with a 4 8 5 goals against an 8 88 save percentage. Patrick tonight will wear their home black sweaters. Rabbit logo on the front, black buckets, black pants, the black socks, the orange trim across, the orange trim around the white numerals on the back of the jerseys. Binghamton Road white, black along the shoulders, green Binghamton written diagonally across the chest. Green numbers with the black outline on those. And we are almost ready for puck drop in Danbury. Hattricks winning last night. The standings as we start tonight. The Hattricks in third place with a 577 points percentage. Carolina with 529 is in fourth. Binghamton 515 in fifth. The Hattricks are 20, excuse me, the Hattricks are 16 points behind second place Columbus as Columbus will play Port Huron tonight at 
Patrick's in a big one tonight, trying to move up to second or at least hold third, and we are underway in Danbury. Right to left, Binghamton drops into the hat tricks in. Wilson out of the net. We'll leave it for Atwell. Pepe, Pepe rather, up the far side to Gesso across the offensive line. Gesso, two goals last night, dumps it down low behind the Binghamton cage. 20 seconds in, Ruiz trying to wrap around side of the net, and Shepard sealed it off. The hat tricks keep in at the point. Atwell drops it in down low. In the corner, it's turned up the wall. D'Angelo knocks it down. Newberg up to center and taken out to the neutral zone. Hattrick circle back there. Mangone at his own blue line. Will go through center up the left wing. Across the line. Stops at the far circle. Down low. The shot is knocked away by Shepard. 45 seconds in. No score. Dowda in the corner. Offensive end to the right. Cannot get the puck free. It's turned back up and out to center. Left to right, into the Binghamton end. It is knocked up the wall by the Black Bears. A minute in, no score, and Yates will take over for Binghamton. Far side, Jurich all the way through center, knocked away by the Hattricks, played right back in. Yates has Jurich streaking in front. It was sealed off by Lazaro. He'll turn it behind the net. 120 into play, no score. Up the far side, Hattricks dealing with a couple of Black Bears in the Danbury zone, but Tom Mealy will find it and drop it back behind his own net for Gallagher. Garrett Gallagher ahead, Dmitry Kuznetsov, first time on the ice tonight. Will skate in a circle around, back to his own zone and out through center. Dancing in between, but the Binghamton defense into the corner. It's played up and out into the neutral zone by Binghamton. Yates right to left across the Hattricks line. The shot kicked away by Wilson. Off to the right side. It's played up the wall, and Yates will take it out to center. Two minutes in. No score. And the Black Bears carry toward the Hattricks end. In on goal, Wilson covers up 2-0-4 in. Billy McCreary behind the bench for the Hattricks tonight, as he was last night in Binghamton with Dave McIsaac suspended after... Wednesday night's game against Watertown. This is the second of his two-game suspension. He'll be back tomorrow. And the Hattricks winning last night with McCreary behind the bench on the road. Able to turn it forward and make it a win on the road last night. 2.15 into play. Hattricks in their own end. It is... Evan Lugo, the Sandy Hook, Connecticut product from Post University, playing through center. His home debut made his professional debut last night, and it's turned out to center into the neutral zone. Oganezov will play into the hat tricks end, far side, two and a half in. Wilson leaves it behind the net for Pepe, who starts up left to right. Shuttling pass out through center, tipped by Mealy and into the offensive zone. Steve Mealy around behind the Binghamton net, shielding the puck far side. It's knocked away. Passed Atwell and carrying to center is Tracy. Toward the hat trick zone, Tracy digs in in the corner. Steve Mealy leaves it against the wall. Pepe will take over three minutes in, no score, and look to outlet out of his own end. Weaving through out of his own zone and feeds Lugo on the left wing. Lugo at the far circle, the rip, saved by Shepard. Rebound, Pepe is gloved by Shepard. 3.06 in the hat tricks. Two newbies on the block, getting it done on that shift. Lugo starting it off and Pepe finishing it with the shot that Shepard hung on to. And the hat tricks. With an offensive zone draw, 3.06 in. No score. We'll send the top line out. Ruiz will take the face off. He can't win it. And it's Turner skating out of his own end. Right to left, the Black Bears come through center. Newberg dumps into the hat trick's end. The Black Bears without Nikita Ivashkin tonight, who is the team's leading scorer with 97 points and 55 goals out of the lineup tonight for Binghamton. Gesso streaks in off to the offensive end, kicks it to his blade, right circle, turns, fires, and it's tipped wide by Boala. Ruiz out in front, stopped to the side. Mangone serves it through the goal mouth, and Gesso lays a huge hit in the corner. That's going to draw a crowd. He's going to get a penalty for it, and him and Boala shoving after the play.
It was Abbott who just so hit in the corner. First time the referees have made a calls tonight. The referees, Gordon Laws and Bill Bird, linesman Michael Imperio and Marty Heiser. Abbott's still down with the trainer tending to him. Gesso and Blala are both in the box. 2.43 in. No score. Abbott to his knees. Will skate off under his own power. Some assistance. And... He is limping on, it looks like his right leg. He'll be tended to behind. Tyler Noseworthy will go across to serve. The minor on Gesso. 3.43 in, uh, Binghamton will get the first power play of the night. The league leading power play for the Black Bears, 23.6%. Patrick's penalty kill at 81.8. Two good units going against each other. Binghamton wins the draw. One timer from the point. Yarwood far side. Saved by Wilson and Jurich will take over. Just about four minutes gone. Ten seconds into a Binghamton power play. No score early in the first. Powell at the center point. Will play across left side. Jurich winds, drives. It's tipped in front. Kirkby shoots it off the glass behind the net and turned up the wall by the hat tricks. They can't clear. Pepe off the wall will play ahead. Yates all the way around behind the hat trick's net. Leaves for Yarwood, drops down low. 420 into play. 120 left on the Binghamton power play. It's Yates down low. Jurich will play it all the way back across right circle. Yates, the wrist shot, saved by Wilson. Rebound in front, turned away, and the shot, they score. Yarwood converts at the side of the net, and Binghamton on the board first. 4.34 into play. Jesso got called for a boarding and a roughing. Boilar, just a roughing, and the extra two on the hat tricks. Cost them the top power play in the league, the only power play in the league above 20%, converts even without the best scorer in eight power play goals. Uh, Nikita Ivashkin out of the lineup tonight. It's the Hattricks who trail early, just about five minutes in, and Binghamton carries through center. Far side, Mealy. Intercepts into the offensive zone for the hat trick. The shot through traffic. Shepard makes the save. And it's a whistle. 457 into play. One nothing. Binghamton leads. Lugo, Steve Neely, and Tyler Noseworthy out for the hat tricks. It is won by Binghamton, turned around behind the net. Noseworthy chases after it, can't get there on the four check. It's turned back in. McDonald plays it back to center. And Black Bears offside, the hat tricks carry through. Steve Neely into the offensive zone, right circle, the wrist shot, down low, blocker saved by Shepard. Noseworthy in the corner has it. Twirls in the corner and is sealed off behind, comes out the near side, turns, fires in front, and it's off Lugo, and it's played around behind. Kirkby and Jurich, the assists for Yarwood's goal. Five and a half in, the hat trick's down by one. Bronner plays ahead to Steve Mealy, it's off his stick and out at center. D'Angelo will take over and play back into the hat trick's end. 14 15 left in the first. 1 0. Binghamton leading. Game two of a three game set. The hat tricks won the first one on the road last night in New York and looking to win the series tonight at home. 
Aaron Atwell behind his own net, patiently waiting to start the rush. Hattricks with a full change, and Atwell will begin up the ice. Long stretch pass tipped into the zone by Bronner, all the way down to the right behind Shepard in the Binghamton net. Powell leaves it behind. Mangone finds it for the Hattricks, turns around in the far corner. 6.20 into play. It comes out to center, and it will be a stoppage in play. Hattricks down 1 0 early in the first 6.22 in. Six twenty-two in first period. One nothing. Black Bears on Cam Yarwood's power play tally. It was his eighth goal of the year. Four of them on the power play for the Black Bears. Neutral zone face-off won by the Hattricks. Hammered in by Atwell around the far boards to the near side. Kuznetsov barreling in. Can't get there. And Mealy will play it ahead. Looking for Kuznetsov. It's into the offensive zone and taken by. Powell for Binghamton into the Hattrick's end, near corner, tips out in front. Atwell finds it on the far side and is played up. Dowda will look to get to center, can't get by. Abbott back on the ice will play the puck to Turner all the way across Powell, far side, out in front, it tips by, Wilson will cover. Abbott had an open net, but Pepe able to seal him off and the puck bounced in front for Wilson to cover it up. 6.58 in, 1-0 Binghamton. Hattrick's missing a few players as well. Steve Brown out of the lineup. Corey Anderson out. Tobias Ojik out. Vinny Susi, Dimitri Daniluk all out of the lineup tonight as they take a defensive zone faceoff. Cleared up to center and out to the neutral zone. Binghamton takes over there. Pekarski up near side. Jurich dumps into the Hattrick's end. All the way around behind the net. Wilson will leave it in the corner. And Lazaro rims it around up the near side for Mangone. The tip to center from Ruiz. Gesso dumps into the offensive end. 7.20 into play. 1-0 Binghamton. Hattricks take it off the wall. Mangone shot. Rebound in front. Ruiz saved with the right arm by Shepard behind the net. Mangone has it for the Hattricks. Seven and a half gone, down one, nothing. Hattricks in the offensive zone. Gallagher right point, his shot deflects to the far circle and Mangone couldn't control it to get a shot away. Hattricks tip back into the offensive zone. Gesso, far circle, sweeping down low, cuts to the front of the net, Mangone the shot, tips wide of the net. Gesso rebound on the near wing, couldn't get it to go and it's Binghamton carrying out. Right to left, Jurich dumps into the Hattricks end near corner. Gallagher there for Danbury, turns it Against the wall and will skate up the right wing. Ahead to Mangone, out of the Hattrick's end. Gains the red line and drives it in. On goal, Shepard will glove it and hold on for a whistle. 8-11 into the first. One nothing, Binghamton leads, 8-11 into the first. Face off in the Black Bears end, one by Binghamton, turned up the wall, out to center, McDonald for the hat trick, dumps it right back in. Behind the Binghamton cage, Yarwood, the goal scorer tonight, will leave it behind the net for Oganezov, and he'll start up the far side. The pass out through center to Sherman, into the hat trick's end, D'Angelo drops back Sherman, the shot blocked by McDonald, and he'll spring forward to Mealy. Mealy up the left wing, across the neutral zone, into the offensive end. Turns by inside the blue line, feeds it across right circle. Bronner was streaking in, but couldn't get there, and Shepard will play it through. Into the hat tricks end, Yarwood side of the net, muscles it out in front. Oliver intercepts his first game in some time for the hat tricks, and will turn it down the ice. Far side, Yarwood, rather, Powell in his own end, nine minutes into the first. Binghamton on top, one nothing. 
Hattrick's out shooting the Black Bears 6-5. Binghamton, a power play goal from Yarwood. Outlet pass from the Black Bears all the way down, tipped into the Hattrick's end. Wilson leaves it in the near corner for Pepe, and he will outlet up the right side. Gets out of his own end, turns around, and backhands to Atwell, far wing. He will skate through center across the red line, dumping into the offensive zone. It tips by, skittering into the corner behind the net. Fitzgerald stopped by Kuznetsov, turned up, down, intercepts left circle, the snap, save up high by Shepard, turned to the wall, and Atwell has it left point. Down low, Dowda in the far corner, rather Tom Mealy takes it behind the Binghamton net, back to the point. Pepe across, Atwell winds and fakes the shot all the way across right circle, banks it off the wall, Fitzgerald intercepts and springs forward. It's out of the reach of Abbott, in on Wilson, he'll cover up. And the whistle blows, 9.58 into the first. one nothing Binghamton. Aaron Atwell taking exception to Abbott, taking a hack at Brian Wilson after the play there. Patricks can't win the draw in their own zone. Shot from the point, kicked away by Wilson. Rebound side of the net, Yates saved again by Wilson. And it's turned by. 9.56 to go in the first, one nothing. Binghamton on top. Nine fifty six left in game seven, nineteen eighty six. New York Mets eight, Boston Red Sox five. Mets win the series. The first period, one nothing. Binghamton on top, 9.56 to go. Ruiz in his own end, will take the face off against Yates. Ruiz wins, Gallagher chips up the wall, can't get it out. Yates keeps it alive, Gallagher finds it for the Hattricks, one hands to center for Mangone to take over. It's pinned up against the Hattricks bench, right in front, and Binghamton comes away with it, but offside at the Danbury line. Neutral zone face off in front of the Hattricks bench. Lugo will take it against Yates. It's won by the Hattricks. Lugo wins it back to Lazaro, who turns up the far wall. It's stuck in the linesman skates and played out to center. Near wing, it is Boilar dumping into the Hattricks end. Far side. Lazaro there for Danbury. Turns it up the wall. Steve Mealy banks ahead. Lugo skates through to center ice. Speeding up the left wing across the Binghamton line. Far side, down low, turns it back out in front. Bronner tips it up in the air. It goes wide of the cage. 9-10 left, the Black Bears outlet out of their own zone. Right to left, Kirkby tips into the Hattricks end. Nine minutes to go, one nothing Binghamton in the first. Easton Oliver takes it out of his own end. On the far wing to Steve Mealy, back to Bronner right side. He'll tip it into the offensive end. Hattricks completing a change. And Oganeza back in his own zone will drop it behind the net for Yarwood. Puck outletted by Binghamton up off of a teammate's body. Noseworthy takes it in center and it is played up through center. But Binghamton takes over. Eight and a half to go. In the first period, Binghamton up one nothing. Hattricks can't get into the offensive zone. Far side, it's played across right wing. Noseworthy carries into the offensive zone. Takes a hit as he dumps the puck into the corner. It comes back out in front. Noseworthy on the shot. It's saved by Shepard. It bounced right to Noseworthy. It's kind of handcuffed. Didn't have a great angle to shoot. And 
He'll go off to the bench. Dowda will take the face off. 8.06 left in the first. one nothing Black Bears. Face off. Won by Binghamton. A big hit along the wall. The Hattricks win the puck back and play it toward the front of the net. It's taken by Yarwood and carried up from Tracy. Dumping into the Hattricks end to the left. Pepe in the corner, whacks it up the wall. Kuznetsov will shuffle to center. Far side, Yarwood will play it around back. 7.35 left in the first. one nothing. Binghamton on top. Tom Mealy skating out of his own end. Left to right across the red line. Swings to the far wing and carries into the offensive zone. Back toward the slot. Drops it right circle. Dowda the rip is saved by Shepard. Back out in front. Dowda rebound. Saved again. Shepard rebound again. Another stop from Shepard. Sliding to his right. Tom Mealy has the puck back on the far wall to Dowda. Bottom of the circle. Dowda cutting toward the front of the net. Wraps around. Tries to wrap it into the near post. It's stopped at the side of the net by D'Angelo and turned up the wall. Abbott will chip it up and out to center. Atwell settles the bouncer at his own blue line for the hat tricks and dumps back into his own end for Lazaro. The outlet to Kuznetsov through center, backhands into the offensive zone. All the way around behind the Binghamton net, 6.45 to go in the first. Black Bears up 1-0, and Binghamton dumps it to center. Hat tricks take over there. Ruiz flings in from the neutral zone, in on goal. Shepard gloves it, and a faceoff will come up in. The offensive zone for the hat tricks. 6.38 left in the first. one nothing. Binghamton on top. Far circle, Black Bears zone. Ruiz to take the draw. Can't win it against Newberg. And it's turned up the near side by Abbott. Tipped up in the air, it goes out to center. Ruiz swats at it, turns forward, it dumps out and into the hat tricks bench. And a face off. Will come up in the neutral zone. 6.27 left in the first one, nothing Black Bears. Ruiz, near circle. Will play it in the neutral zone and win it forward. Mangone dumps in. 6.20 left, 1 0 Hattricks in, 1 0 Black Bears rather, excuse me, in the first. And it's dumped all the way back to the Hattrick zone. Lazaro turns up the wall. Gesso takes it off the kick plate, circles around in his own end, and will start up the ice. Dances in front of his own net and comes out to center. Weaves his way through Turner across the Binghamton line. Dances by Ruiz, finds the rebound. Right side, bounces down low, and it's Mangone in the corner who will take it back up high. He'll circle back to the left side. McDonald, the shot goes high and wide over the net and out to center. Oliver tries to keep it alive, but it's Fitzgerald carrying right to left across Hattrick's line. Comes down low, high shot on Wilson. He shrugs it down. Five and a half left. Yates out to the slot. The shot goes up and over. Wilson bounces up to the point. Powell keeps in. Dumps down low around Yates, cutting to the side of the net. Trying on the wraparound. Cuts back to the far side. Knocked away by McDonald's side of the cage. And Gesso will knuckle it to center. Mangone catches up in the offensive zone. Dances to the front of the net. The backhand save. Right leg by Shepard, and Mangone has the rebound. Back up high. The shot off a of body blocked by Pekarski. Mangone has the rebound back. Sliding across left point. He'll dance through to the slot. Comes out in front. The rip is off a of body up and out of play. Mangone flying on that shift. Just couldn't get the shot to get through the traffic. 5.02 left in the first. one nothing Black Bears. Hat tricks. Have an offensive zone face-off. It's Lugo on the far wing. And the Hattricks put the face-off toward the corner. Binghamton takes over along the wall. Jurich scoops out the center. Under five to play in the first. one nothing Binghamton. Atwell cycles back into his own end. Turns up the far wall to the near side. Bronner dumps into the offensive end. Lays a hit as he dumps it in. And the fans enjoy that. Phil Bronner in his second home game back with the Hattricks this season. And it is dumped.
by into the far boards. Atwell back toward the Binghamton end from the neutral zone, dumps around and will whip it around. The boards, Bronner takes it near side, down low to Mealy. Works it back up top, Bronner to the point, Dowda will play it down low toward the corner. Hattrick's in the middle of a change, so nobody there. 4-10 left in the first, one nothing Black Bears. Kirkby through center, backhands into the Hattrick's end. Lazaro intercepts, his outlet hits a body, and Kirkby has it back into the Hattrick's end, right circle. Swing around behind, the net coming out near side. Will be on his backhand, the net comes off as Wilson tried to push. And we will step aside in Danbury. 3.58 to go in the first one nothing Black Bears. Three fifty-eight left in the first one. Nothing. Black Bears face off in the hat trick zone. To our left, Dowda will take against D'Angelo. Right circle. Wilson looking on near side. It is Dowda to win it forward. Mealy can't clear the shot. Tipped in. Wilson makes the stop with his right leg, kicking out. It's off to the near wall. Binghamton takes over. Tracy plays it across through the slot. It bounces to. Sherman on the far wing, out in front. Yarwood stops at the side of the net. Wilson makes the stop. 3.38 to go in the first. Dowda trying to muscle to center. He does work it free, and Binghamton will take over there. Three and a half left in the first. One nothing, Black Bears lead. And the Black Bears go in offside at the hat tricks line. Three twenty-seven left, first period, one nothing. Binghamton on top. It is a neutral zone faceoff, one by Danbury. Jesso will charge up the right wing, banks it into the offensive zone near wing. Will take it into the corner, around behind the net, kicks it back to his stick from below the goal line, drops it back for Ruiz side of the net, chopping away at it, and it's blocked in front by Newbert. Ruiz works it free, high slot, the shot kicked away. Shepard and played by Man going back to the point. McDonald D to D, Oliver right side shot goes wide of the net and banks out to McDonald. He'll one time it from the point and hits a body in front, bounces around. Jesso finds it on the right circle. Plays across Mangone, left side. The snap, off a of body, sliding out the block. It was Boilar into the corner. Jesso has it right back, down low into the corner for Ruiz. Behind the cage, out in front, Mangone had it tipped away from him, and he has it back at the right circle. Patrick cycling, center point, Mangone through traffic. It's gloved by Shepard, 239 left. Hattricks with some pressure on the last couple shifts, but unable to get a puck past Shepard so far. 17 shots for the Hattricks in this period, and all 17 have been stopped by Joe Shepard. Steve Mealy face off near side, wins it to Bronner. Pepe the shot from the point, tipped wide by Mealy, trying on the wraparound, and he stopped at the side of the net. Far circle, Mealy will dump it back to the point. Atwell pushes down low, but it's Binghamton the other way. Kirkby across the Hattrick's line, right side, out in front. Yates, the shot, sealed off by Wilson. Two on one, and the Hattricks had Pepe back. He's able to seal off the shot. Wilson took care of the pass. And the Hattricks get a big save from their goaltender. Far side, Atwell in the neutral zone, plays it forward, dumped into the offensive end and all the way around. Fitzgerald will play up for Jurich. Binghamton backing down in their own end. Lugo forces the turnover, passes toward Dowda. It was intercepted. Kuznetsov in offside with 154 left. First period, 1-0. 
Binghamton leads. Dowda in the neutral zone will win the faceoff back. Gallagher ahead off the bench and into the Binghamton end right side. 145 left in the first. Yarwood up the far wing. Stopped by Mealy but can't control it. Tracy carries forward for Binghamton. Chipped ahead by the Hattricks in the neutral zone. Binghamton swats back toward the Hattricks end. Black Bears in the neutral zone. D'Angelo along the far wall to Sherman who Pumps it into the hat-trick zone. Behind the net, Gallagher takes over for Danbury. Up the left wing to Dowda. Cross ice feed, Tom Mealy through center. Kuznetsov into the offensive end, right wing. Swings down low, all the way across. No one there for the hat-tricks. It's Tracy who outlets. Sherman up the right wing, right to left. 1.15 left in the period. 1-0 Binghamton. Sherman backs to Fitzgerald. The shot in front, they score. It was D'Angelo who took the shot. It hit a body in front, bounced right to Tom Tracy who scores past Wilson, 107 left in the period. Tracy gets his third goal of the year, and the Hattricks are down 2-0. Tough bounce for the Hattricks. They played it. They blocked the shot, but... The rebound went right to Tracy, who was all alone. Wilson couldn't slide across in time. Last minute of the first, Hattricks move up left to right through center. Ruiz on the right wing. Will skate by and into the offensive zone in the corner. Over skates and keeps the puck by along behind the net. Plays it back up high. It was blocked. Jurich will scoop it out. Past Gates in the neutral zone. Wilson, or rather, Oliver will play it along to Gesso, who turns forward to center. 30 seconds in the period. Gesso skates across the offensive line, will fall down in the corner, trying to work it free to the slot. He couldn't control the pass. It's banked out to center. Kirkby in the neutral zone. Stopped by Ruiz. Hattrick carry in. 18 seconds to go. Atwell right side. Dances by and stopped, and it will be played out by Binghamton. Fitzgerald in his own end. Playing across, eight seconds to go. Powell behind the Black Bears net to Fitzgerald, who just holds it up in the corner, and that will do it for the first period. 2-0 Black Bears after one. It was 434 in. Yarwood converted on the power play, and with just 107 left, Tom Tracy adds to the Black Bears lead, and after one period, it is 2-0 Binghamton. We'll be back on the Hattricks YouTube channel for the second. It's 2-0 Binghamton after one.
ready to go in the second. Patricks and Black Bears. It's 2-0 Binghamton after one period, and we are underway in the second. Hattricks moving right to left will take over through the neutral zone up the left wing. It is tipped by and into the offensive zone. Around behind the Black Bears net, turned up and over far wing. Pekarski will take it up the near side and up to Turner, who kicks it by. And Hattricks looking to work it free. It's played up and gloved down by Ruiz. Jesso couldn't touch it or else it would have been a hand pass. So Binghamton knocks it forward. In the neutral zone, Jesso working it free, dumps into the offensive zone. Man going far side, plays it back out in front through Jesso. It goes all the way by and out at center. Right to left, Hattricks right back into the offensive end around the boards, 50 seconds in to the second. 2-0, Hattricks trailing, Mangone left side will shoot, it's blocked by Pekarski, drop back, Turner can't get past Lazaro near point. 105 in, Hattricks playing it down in the corner, Gesso turns it for Dowda behind. Dowda working his way back out in front and it is knocked up and out. Taken by Turner through center, dumping in on goal. Wilson will leave it to the side and Lazaro will take over. 90 seconds in to the second, 2-0 Binghamton. Black Bears in the neutral zone. Yates carries across the Atrix line but Jurich will turn back to center. On the right wing, Jurich Bumps it back to Fitzgerald, who will work up left to right. Dropping on the slingshot for Jurich. Around and in the Binghamton end. The Black Bears will outlet. Left to right, Powell across the Hattricks line. 155 into the second. All the way across Kirkby, far corner, out in front. Tip try, and it's saved by Wilson. Hattricks carry out, right to left, Kuznetsov. All the way through Tom Mealy, streaking into the zone. Left circle, the shot! It's blocked by Fitzgerald up and out of play. 2.09 into the second. Hattricks down to nothing. A nice counter on the rush, but unable to get the shot on goal, and it was blocked away. Two oh nine in to the second. Two nothing Binghamton. Hattricks win the faceoff offensive zone. McDonald fires it wide of the net. Oliver pinches in, far side to keep it alive. Steve Mealy up the wall. It is turned up by Mealy, and he is upended. And a high stick called against Mealy. It appears the Hattricks will head shorthanded, and Binghamton have another chance, one for one so far tonight on the power play. Far circle, Hattrick's end, it's won by Binghamton and they start the power play. Jurek blast, it's saved by Wilson. 2.32 into the second, eight seconds into a Binghamton power play, two nothing, Black Bears. Face off. One by Binghamton, shot in toward goal. Yarwood digging away at it. He finds it in the slot. Hattricks work it toward the side in the corner. Pepe can't control it. 20 seconds into the power play. Mealy off for a high sticking. Just about three gone in the second. Binghamton looking to go up 3 nothing. Yarwood across to Powell at the point. Back to Yarwood. It is taken down low. Yates slides it out in front. Kirkby the shot. Stoned by Wilson. The Hattricks clear. All the way down, a big stop from Wilson. And the Hattricks able to get out of the zone. 115 left on the kill for Danbury. Back in to the Hattricks end, side of the net, cleared all the way down by Danbury. Halfway through the power play. Two nothing, Binghamton leading. 
left to right. The Black Bears come through center on the power play. Across the red line, it is Gates across the Hattricks line. Right side, right circle, he'll dump it back to Yarwood at the point. Slinging down to the hash mark, side of the net, Gates looks out in front, back to the corner. He'll go around behind the net, 35 to go on the power play for Binghamton. Yates all the way in the corner, near side, slings it back behind the net, far wing, and the pass from Powell goes all the way out to center, back to the Binghamton zone. Four minutes gone in the second, 2-0 Black Bears. And on the power play for 15 more seconds, Binghamton into the hat-trick's end. Sherman left side, drops for Yarwood, dangles away, and back to the point. Powell shot, tip in front, wide of the net. Off to the near wing, Ruiz. Backhands forward, Mangone racing forward. A shorthanded goal last night. Mangone shoots just wide of the net, and it's tipped up out to center. Ruiz knocks it back in. He'll go offside, and the hat tricks get Mealy out of the box. 4.25 into the second. Still 2-0 Binghamton. Ruiz in the neutral zone against Newberg. It's won by the Hattricks. Far side, Pepe will rim it around the boards, all the way around near side. Gesso can't keep it in. Kicked by Atwell. Hattricks offside. It goes back into the corner where Fitzgerald will take over for Binghamton. 440 into the second, 2 0 Black Bears. Boilar up the left wing. Tips in by Turner and into the Hattricks end. Turner skates by, sealed off into the corner from Pepe and. Atwell clears it up the wall, can't get it by Abbott. Side of the net, Atwell intervenes, takes it back for the Hattricks, works to center, backhands across near side, intercepted by Abbott. Into the Hattricks zone, their shot rips, rips wide of the net, and far wing, Newberg will play it back down low. Ruiz hit up high, a penalty coming up against Binghamton. Gesso skates out in front of his own net and gets to center. Right side, as Gesso through center, scrum behind the net, Abbott, Will go off. He dropped. He lost one of his gloves. And we'll step aside here. 5-16 into the second. 2-0 Black Bears. Patrick's to the power play when we come back. Sixteen into the second, two nothing Black Bears. Hattricks to the power play. Abbott off for high sticking, and the Hattricks get their first chance on the man advantage tonight. Power play at seventeen point one percent for the Hattricks. Binghamton's penalty kill seventy nine percent. Hattricks need one early in the second here to try and get back in this one. Atwell on the near wing turns it by Steve Mealy left circle. Hattrick set up on the power play. Kuznetsov along the hash marks. Mealy back to Kuznetsov. Cuts to the slot. The shot. He scores! Kuznetsov rips it by Shepard in the top corner. Hattricks cut the lead to one. It's 2 1 Binghamton. 5 25 into the second. Kuznetsov on the power play. It's his 32nd of the year. Hattricks with Kuznetsov on the power play. The shot just ripped by under the bar. And the Hattricks are on top. Two 
or, or rather cut the lead, excuse me, two to one, Binghamton, and a much needed goal on the power play for Danbury. Able to cut the lead, Kuznetsov rips it by and the hat tricks convert on the power play early on in it. They won the face off and right away got set up. Left side, it was Kuznetsov. From the circle, over the right shoulder of Shepard and beat the Binghamton goaltender. They'll clean up the carrots. Hattricks lead it, or rather <laughs> Binghamton leads. 2-1, Hattricks on the board. 18 shots for the Hattricks so far. And this one, 14 for Binghamton. Five twenty-five into the second, two-one. Binghamton on top. Hattricks convert on the power play, and are ready to go at center ice to get things started again. Steve Mealy will take the face off with Lugo and Bronner on his wings. D'Angelo for Binghamton. Tracy and Sherman up front for Binghamton as well. Hattricks win the draw. Dump into the offensive end. Five and a half into the second. Danbury. Just getting on the board. Bronner down low in the offensive zone. Turns it out in front. Mealy couldn't get the shot away. Into the corner. Bronner takes over. Turns it around behind the net. Mealy near side. Will come back to the hash marks. Play it back to the point out. Well, back to Mealy. Left wall. Will shoot off a body. It bounces to Sherman. And Binghamton out left. Left to right. D'Angelo across the hat tricks line. Trying to get by Atwell. He sealed off. Atwell outlets to Mealy. Three on two for the hat tricks. Steve Mealy across the left circle, across Lugo in front, the shot blocked, and he's turned into the corner with the puck. Back out in front, and Matrix take over along the bottom of the zone. Back up high, hops over Pepe's stick, and out to center. In the neutral zone, Hattrick's push it forward. It's Sherman into the Danbury end. Tracy tips down low, back to Sherman below the goal line around, trying the wraparound, stuffs it all the way back up high. high. And Ruiz will finish. Yarwood up in the top of the zone, behind the net. It's turned up by Atwell all the way down. Ruiz cancels the icing. Behind the net, he has it in the Binghamton end, twirls a by and trying to get it work out in front. He couldn't control it. He has it back. Far side, Gallagher walks in, winds, drives, and hits, sure, and hits Shepard in front, and it's cleared to center. Gallagher into the offensive end for the hat tricks as they were changing, so Binghamton will take over. 7 10 into the second, 2 1. Black Bears lead. Patrick's in the neutral zone, turn it forward into the offensive end, and Gesso leaves it across. It's top of the slot, Mangone shot off a of body. He has the rebound back on the far wall. Pinned up against the wall by Yates and Powell. Three hat tricks in, digging away. Dowda can't work it free, and it does come to the point. Hat tricks turn it back down low. Gesso pushing Powell against the far wall. It's turned around the near boards. Jurich will knock it up to center. Hat tricks take over. Dowda in the neutral zone, right back toward the Binghamton line, but it's stopped. Lazaro will dump back in, and Binghamton takes over in its own end. Yates up the right side, near wing, will chip it out to center. Hattricks intervene, but it's Jurich into that Danbury end. All the way across, Powell back in front, and Jurich was tied up. Near side, Kirkby will play it along the boards. Hattricks intercept and drop up to Gallagher. Left side, Tom Mealy shrieking into the zone, trying to play it out in front. Can't get it by to Kuznetsov. It's dumped up the far wing. Kuznetsov lays a hit, dumps it down low into the corner, and tries to find Dowda with the puck. He cannot. It's out at center. McDonald working it free. Hattricks play it ahead, but not into the offensive zone. Jurich whacks it toward the Danbury end. 
8.40 into the second. 2-1, Black Bears on top. Kuznetsov, the goal scorer for the hat tricks, turns back into his own teammate, and Turner carries into the hat tricks end. Dancing by out in front, the shot saved by Wilson. Kuznetsov has the rebound, a long stretch pass off the end boards, and Mealy can't catch up to it in the Binghamton end. Shepard will turn it up the wall. 11 minutes to go in the second. Hattrick's down one. Binghamton out to center. Turner off to the right wing. Newberg into the Hattrick's end. Right side will shoot. It's blocker down by Wilson. Mealy will turn around in his own end. Play it toward his brother Tom, but he couldn't catch up to it. And Powell will take over for the Black Bears. 9.20 into the second. 2-1 Black Bears in the neutral zone. Pepe for the Hattricks. Works toward the Binghamton end. Gets across the line. Lost control as he got in. And Bronner unable to keep it in the zone. He'll turn it back in. Abbott will skate through into the Hattricks end. Stopped by Wilson out of the net to chip it up. Through center. Bronner plays it toward Noseworthy. He couldn't settle it. And it's out into the Hattricks end. Atwell plays it ahead. It's into the Binghamton zone. They'll play it forward. Left to right. Tracy into the Hattrick's end. Gabbitt, Abbott rather, will play it across in the corner. He is knocked down. Bronner knocks down Tracy in the corner, and the Hattricks work the puck up. Lugo ahead to the neutral zone, and it's hammered right back in by Binghamton. Pepe along the far wall will outlet, looking for Noseworthy in center. Bouncing puck settled by Sherman for the Black Bears. 9.40 to go in the second. It's 2-1 Binghamton. Into the hat trick stand in the corner. Pepe turns it around the boards. Far side, Bronner lets it go up the wall. Atwell can't get a stick on it. It's Binghamton. Left circle, D'Angelo all alone. Feeds it in front. Sealed off by Wilson. And he'll hold on. 9.26 to go in the second. 2-1. to one. Black Bears on top. Nine twenty-six left in the second. Two to one. Two to one. Black Bears. Nine and a half to go in the second. Patrick's in their own end. Win the faceoff, but can't clear. Kirkby along the far wall. Lazaro turns him down low. Jesso tips it behind, and Gallagher finds it up the near wing. Gallagher right to left through center ice, in front of his own bench across the line. Dumps down low, shots out of the net, and it's sealed off by Shepard. Gallagher getting his legs moving through center ice, and might as well just take it to the net. Patrick's will get an offensive zone draw out of it. Offensive zone, Hatricks. Left circle, Dowda will take it, 9.05 left, down by one in the second. He wins it back, McDonald left point, the shot through traffic, and Dowda couldn't get a tip on it. Shepard smothers it, and another face-off will come up. Eight fifty nine to go, second period, 2-1, Black Bears, and Binghamton wins the draw in its own zone. Tipped up the far side from Oganezov, out to center. Smacked back in by Kuznetsov, and the Hattricks have to recoil. In center, Kuznetsov will chip it off the glass. It bounces toward the Binghamton zone, and Oganezov will take over. Across to Yarwood, and out to center. Tipped into the Hattricks end. It was from before the red line. It will be icing against Binghamton. Happy 91st birthday. Tick Mike. Happy 91st birthday, Tick Mike. Happy 
8.35 left, second period, two to one, Black Bears. Offensive zone draw for the Hattricks, one by Dowda, back at the point, Atwell, hard around the boards, behind the net, and Kuznetsov will take over in the corner, he lost control, Mealy crashes into Kirkby, the Hattricks take the puck back, Mealy behind the net, Tom Mealy off to the near wing. Cuts to the left circle, slides it down low, looking for Dowd at the side of the cage. Couldn't get there. Mealy finds it back along the wall. Gloves it down to himself, plays back to the point. Pepe shot through traffic, gloved by Shepard. He'll hold on. The hat tricks worked it down low, played it up high to Pepe. His shot gloved by Shepard, and it will be another faceoff in the offensive zone. Steve Mealy to take the face off, 8-10 left in the second, down 2-1. He wins the draw back, Pepe shot off a of body, goes into the corner, Lugo ca crashes in, and the penalty will be on the hat tricks. Lugo getting called for a penalty and the Hattricks will go to the penalty kill. Cybers penalty kill. And get ready for the Cybers penalty kill. Ruiz will take the face off in his own circle. Far side, he can't win it. Powell at the point. Dangerous, Binghamton power play. Yarwood already scored once on the power play tonight. Has it at the right circle, skates down low. The shot rides up off of Gallagher's stick and up out of play. 7.51 left in the second. 1.49 on the power play for Binghamton. Lugo off for a trip. Patricks with Ruiz taking the face off. It's one by Gates, but Bronner steps in and clears it all the way down. 20 seconds into the kill for the Hattricks. 7.40 to go in the second period. Down two to one. Hattricks need to get this kill. Yates across the Hattricks line, right side, looking on the overlap to the bottom of the zone. It's Yarwood behind the net, comes out the far wing and plays to Jurich. Left circle, Jurich back to the point. It's Powell skating in, slides it across left circle, the blast off the side of the net. It turns up to Kirkby on the corner. 1-10 left on the power play for Binghamton, 7-10 in the second. 2-1 to one Black Bears, down low Yates in the corner. Up high Powell, right point, will look back down low side of the net to Kirkby, who takes it back up high. Powell shoots through traffic, blocked by Ruiz into the corner. Gallagher finds it and will clear all the way down for the hat tricks. 45 seconds to go on the penalty kill, 6.46 in the second. Black Bears up one, looking to add with a power play. Fitzgerald up the left wing into the Hattrick's end. Far side will take it down to the circle. Banks it behind the net around a Jurich on the right point. Slides it back down low behind the net. Atwell intercepts, looking to turn up the wall. Can't get it by, and Yates seals him off. Yates has the puck back on the circle. Sliding down low and turns around at the circles. The shot kicked around, rebound in front. Wilson battling away at it and they score. The hat trick couldn't find the rebound and it was Jurich who found it for Binghamton. He puts it home. It's three to one Black Bears, their second power play goal of the game. Jurich, his 50th goal of the year and 14 of them have now come on the power play. Three to one the score with 6-11 left in the second. Patrick's win the faceoff in center. It's played to Mealy, who will turn back at the neutral zone. And the pass into his brother goes in offside. Tom to Steve. 
Sherman and Fitzgerald get the assists for Jurich. And it's back to a two goal lead for Binghamton. Six minutes to go in the second. And the hat tricks win the face off in the neutral zone. Turned up the wall and into the offensive end. Turned down low in the hat trick zone. Played up and Oliver will find it in the hat tricks offensive zone. Out in front, Kuznetsov one timer stuffs it wide of the net. Neely into the corner with Kuznetsov, works it down low behind the net. Neely lost his stick, has to go back for it with five and a half to go in the second. Binghamton will outlet to center. Oliver stops it at the hat tricks line. It's turned back down low. Danbury zone. And Danbury will outlet. Right to left through center. It is the hat tricks playing the puck down, and Binghamton will push it back toward the hat trick zone, off, or icing called, with 5.15 left. Second period. Five fifteen to go, second period, 3-1. Binghamton on top. Ruiz will win the face-off offensive end. Jesso looking to drop back to the point, dances down low instead, and is sealed off in the corner. He still has the puck on his stick. Back to Ruiz at the circle, dancing around, trying to pull the puck free. Couldn't, but in the corner, Jesso finds it. Working his way toward the top of the circle, he was muscled off the puck. Played out to center, Pepe will control him. Tips it forward, Jesso dunks into the offensive end. Binghamton takes over, clearing all the way down. Hattrick zone, Atwell settles behind his own net. Under five to play in the second. Three to one, Black Bears. Jesso across the offensive line, plays across for Wees, dumps it for Mangone, and it was intercepted. Tracy back the other way for Binghamton, banking toward D'Angelo in the Hattrick end. Sealed off in the corner, Atwell rims it up the wall. Near side, Sherman keeps it alive, kicks it down low. Atwell intercepts again. Out in front of his own net, Atwell lost control, and it is Binghamton to take over. Mangone strips the Black Bears and carries to center for Danbury. Skates all the way around in a circle, back to the neutral zone, into the offensive end. The shot off of Yarwood, into the far corner, 4.05 left in the second. Mangone hit off the puck, it's cleared out to center. Gallagher will find it and play it in to the offensive zone. Binghamton takes over there in their own end. 3.45 left in the second. It's played all the way down into the Hattrick's end. Lazaro behind his own net, leaves for Gallagher. It comes out to Tracy, looking out in front, takes it to the circle, the shot, saved by Wilson, up and out of play. 3.34 left in the second, three to one. Binghamton on top. Three thirty-four left in the second. Three to one, Black Bears. Patrick's in their own end with a face-off. Mealy against Yates. Steve Mealy can't win it. Yates back to the point. It is Oganezov who falls down. Bronner looks to get to center, but couldn't catch up to it. Yarwood there first. Cuts back around his own net. Yarwood and up left to right through center. Kirkby across the red line and right, right wing. Jurich into the hat trick's end. Lost control into the corner. Lazaro pins him against the wall. It's turned up by the hat tricks, and Bronner will skip it out to center. Noseworthy settles at the red line, dumps it across into the offensive zone. 
and plays it around back. Players collide with the referee along the far wing, and it is Binghamton coming away with the puck. Under three to play in the period. Down by two, the hat tricks back in their own end. Yates around behind the net to Jurich, who's stopped by Gallagher in the corner. Gallagher wins the puck across into the other corner. Far wing, Dowda chases after it, turns it around, plays it toward the front of his net. Oliver there, plays across, and Bronner will chip it up. Out to center, flagged down by Yarwood, played right back into the hat-trick's end by Yates. Two and a half to play, Yates goes between his legs, cut toward the front of the net, and the pass in front, knocked away by the hat-tricks. Jurich turns and fires wide of the net. It's Gallagher to take over, and he'll play it up to Bronner. Far side, right wing, it is Dowda across the Binghamton line, dumps into the corner. Tom Mealy chases there, bangs Newberg into the wall, and with 2.10 left, Binghamton will get out of its own zone. Patrick's take over in the neutral zone. Pepe will play it off the wall into the offensive end. It's banked out to center. Hattricks have to settle there. And it hits Dowda on the dump in. So they're offside with 155 left in the second. It is three to one. Binghamton. Far side in the neutral zone. Ruiz will take the draw, wins it back. Pepe dumps into the offensive end to the left. Gesso chases in on the four check. He forces the turnover behind, out in front toward the slot. Ruiz was streaking in, but he was intercepted and cleared all the way down. They'll be icing if Pepe can get there first, and he does. So it'll be a face-off back in the Binghamton end. Special welcome to the C-Mac group here tonight. The C-Mac group is in the building. 141 left in the second, three to one. Binghamton on top. Far circle offensive end, Ruiz can't win the draw. Tried to forward and it's knocked up to center by Binghamton. Back in the neutral zone, Mangone chases along in front of the Hattricks bench, works it forward, Gesso back to Ruiz, but he was in offside, so Ruiz holds up in the neutral zone. He'll chip it by and can't quite get in deep. Binghamton back in its own end, Powell with 1.15 to go in the second, plays it through center, it's Gesso who blocks it and carries into the offensive zone, the shot rips high and wide off the glass, all the way out to center, off of Pepe, and Turner will carry into the Hattricks zone. Looking to get by Atwell, who seals him off into the corner. Puck trickling along the wall. Abbott will turn it around there in the corner. Under a minute to play in the second. Three to one, Black Bears. Hattricks outlet to center. It's past Gesso up the left wing. He'll skate into the offensive end and play it around behind the net. He spins his wheels a little bit as he's knocked down, and it's played up through center for Turner. 38 seconds left in the period. Binghamton at the Hattricks line. Dowda stops it, and Gesso sc sc scurries forward into the offensive zone. Drops for Dowda across, and Mangone couldn't hold on to it. He'll circle back to the point, and his pass is knocked out to center. Sherman into the Hattricks end with 20 seconds left in the period. Three to one, Binghamton on top. Lazaro. Will play it out. D'Angelo finds it. The shot is smothered by Wilson. 8.1 to go. Lazaro turned it over in the slot, and D'Angelo able to make the shot. And Wilson able to stop it. 8.1 left in the second. 3-1 Black Bears, face off in the hat trick's end, tied up in the circle near side. The shot in from Tracy, another save by Wilson late in the period. 3.9 left. Hattricks win the draw. It's played by, and in the corner, the uh, Hattricks will play it across in the corner. That horn sounds, and that'll do it for the second. Three to one, Binghamton after two periods. Hattricks have some work to do in the third, and we'll have it for you here on the Hattricks YouTube channel. After two, Binghamton up three to one.
Almost set for the third period in Danbury. It's three to one Binghamton after 40 minutes. The Hattricks need to make something happen in the third period. Trying to hold on to that third place spot in the league. Goal summary from tonight. It was first two for Binghamton. They led 2-0. Cam Yarwood on the power play started things off early in the first. Then Tom Tracy from Dino, Gino D'Angelo and Yarwood again, who has two points tonight. Kuznetsov answered with a power play goal for the Hattricks from Dowda and Steve Neely. Then Jurich, another power play goal for Binghamton, made it a 3-1 game for the Black Bears. Ready to go in the third. Hattricks will move left to right. Binghamton right to left. Ruiz against Newberg in the circle. It's won by the Hattricks. We're underway in the third. Pepe off to the far wing. Gesso will skate in. Left circle rips it all the way through and into the corner. Back up high. Mangone pops it in the air and can't get it forward. Deep into the Binghamton end. It's all the way back ahead. Icing against the Black Bears. Hattricks... We'll have an offensive zone draw, 23 seconds into the third. Ruiz will take near circle, offensive end, 23 seconds into the third, down by two. He wins it back, Gesso, top of the right circle, will walk by and bank it back to the point. Pepe. Along the right point, slides it across Atwell, winds, lets it fly off the end board side of the cage. Jessa works it back toward the front of the net. It's knocked away. He'll have it back in the corner. Turning it down low off the corner boards. It's taken by Binghamton. Jesso can't catch up to it. Atwell tried to pinch in and also couldn't control. It's out the center where Atwell does take over. Jesso right back into the offensive end. Binghamton, or rather, Mangone will play it around the side of the net and turn it up high. Ruiz will bounce it down low for Gesso. A minute into the third. Hattricks down two. Gesso working around and will it will be put up the wall. Atwell kicks it down, trying to get it out of a pair of Binghamton skates, and he cannot. It's out to center. Danbury will dump it right back in. Eighteen and a half to go in regulation. Three to one. Binghamton leads. Boilar up the left side all the way through. It's tipped in. Yates will skate into the hat-trick zone. On the left wing, the shot wide of the net and turned up the wall. It's up to the hat -tricks. Kuznetsov will play it ahead and work it to center. All the way back down into the Danbury end. Wilson will play it. And behind the net, Gallagher takes over. Off to the near wing. Two minutes gone in the third. The hat -tricks Play it all the way down, icing waved off, and Dowda will go in on the four check. It's Fitzgerald for Binghamton to start back behind the net. Powell from the Binghamton end to Fitzgerald over two minutes into the third. Binghamton up two. Tipped into the hat-trick's end to the left by Jurich. Far wing all the way around. Wilson leaves it behind the cage. McDonald will take over for Danbury. Up the far side. Johnny McDonald up the left wing. Across the red line and into the Binghamton end. He'll knock it in deep. Side of the net. Steve Mealy can't get a hold on it. And Binghamton will take it behind its own net with Powell. Up the far side, Jurich will bank it ahead to center. McDonald settles there for the hat tricks, tipped in by Bronner, and it will be Shepard out of the net to play it. Shepard making 23 saves through the first two periods and change tonight. Brian Wilson, 18 saves on the other end. 17 minutes left in regulation. Hat tricks down by two. Atwell on the far wing. It is taken by. The uh, Black Bears in the neutral zone, played all the way down. D'Angelo around behind the net, out in front. Sherman, the shot wide, and it bounces up to Bronner in the neutral zone, where he'll play it across to Pepe. 
Across the red line, into the offensive end. Jesso, right side, will streak down the shot. He scores! Jesso roots it over the shoulder of Shepard. In the top corner on the far side. It's a 3-2 game early in the third. Just 3.26 in. Jesso's 19th after scoring twice last night. He's on the board tonight. And it's a big one for the Hattricks, making it a one-goal game. Three twenty-six into the third. It is three to Binghamton. The Hattricks will win the faceoff at center and kicked forward. The Black Bears will take over in the neutral zone. They rim it around into the Hattricks end. Wilson leaves it behind the net to play, and it will be Lazaro up the wing into the. Binghamton and he stopped. Tracy back the other way, across the Hattrix line, right circle, swings down low, dumps it behind the net, crunched by Gallagher, and Lazaro will take up the near wing. Four minutes gone in the third, 3-2 Binghamton. Early goal for the Hattrix in the third. Out in the top of the zone, a shot in on goal, so sticked aside by the Hattrix, and it is Sherman. Up the near side. Brendan Pepe gets his first career professional point on the on an assist for Gesso. And Bronner gets the other. Hattricks within one. Four and a half into the third. Yarwood on the far side. Hattricks in. We'll take it up the far side on the wall. And Ruiz can't handle it. Tracy takes it off the wall in front. Gallagher scoops it to the corner. Off the end boards, D'Angelo stopped by the Hattricks, turned up and out at center. It is played down. Into the Binghamton zone. Right side, Newberg out to center. Abbott will play in, and it is dunked into the Hattricks end. Oliver will take it behind the net and he falls down. Dowda will be able to take it out for the Hattricks. Up to Kuznetsov through center, chips in far side into the Binghamton net. Tom Mealy there behind the offensive net will whip it around up to the near boards. It's Oliver off to the left wing. McDonald's shot hits a body in front and Dowda will take it around into the corner playing back up to the point. Oliver down across to McDonald, back to the near wing. Oliver Sean is sticked away by Shepard, settled down by Mealy, and it's played to the side of the net. Up the boards, Oliver pinches in. 5.50 into the third. It's around behind the Binghamton net, chipped up to center, and Turner will carry ahead. Six minutes in to the third, into the Hattrick's end. Abbott turns it toward goal. That goes all the way through. The Hattricks find it. Kuznetsov. Dancing through the neutral zone, can't hold on into the offensive end, and it's tipped back into the hat-trick zone. Atwell will take over, 6-15 into the third, 3-2. Binghamton leads. Atwell up the far side. It is Pepe into the hat-tricks, into the neutral zone, or it's turned over. Yates into the hat-trick end. Jurich across. Kirkby the shot rips high and wide. And Noseworthy chases after it far wing. Can't get there. Atwell blocks his shot into the corner. Yates along the far wing will skate it up high. Yates turning it around. And the shot from the Yarwood blocked by Mealy. As Noseworthy will skate ahead. Gaining the red line. Tips into the offensive zone and goes by into the Binghamton end. Black Bears take over behind their own net. Jurich will start up. Right side, skies it high in the air and knuckles into the hat-trick zone. Seven minutes into the third. 3-2. Binghamton on top. Puck hops off the corner. Jesso will take it out of his own end. Left to right, up the right wing. Across the Binghamton line. Swings right circle. Fires it out in front. Kicked away by Shepard. Lazaro keeps it in far side. At the circle, will play it off a of body. It bounces back out to center. 12 and a half to go in the third. 3-2 Binghamton, Gallagher back into the Binghamton end, far side, backhands toward the slot, it's kicked away by Shepard, rebound into the corner, Jesso barrels in, and the puck hops along to the far wall. 
Clipped up to center. Tracy carries in to the hat-trick end for Binghamton. Right side, shot tipped away by Wilson. Into the near corner and up the wall. The hat chip it up and out to the neutral zone. Yarwood will take over there. 12-10 to go in the third. 3-2, Binghamton. Puck steers in on goal. Wilson will tip it aside. Man going on the stretch pass into the offensive zone. All alone will shoot. It's tipped up and out of play. 8-0-2 into the third. We'll step aside. Hattricks down one. into the third. Hattrick down by one. A faceoff coming up for Danbury in the offensive zone. Dowda will take it. 11.58 left in regulation. The Hattrick's down a goal. Dowda, far circle, wins it into the corner, takes over. Turns it back up high at the top of the ring. Will Fire it back down low. Mealy off the wall. Tom Mealy to the slot. The shot under Shepard. He doesn't know where it is, and they blow it dead. It was a shot along the ice. Shepard looked like he, he wasn't sure if he had it, but the referees blow the puck dead and face off again in the offensive end for Danbury. Far circle on the left for Dowda to take. He wins it. Pushes it forward, it's won by Binghamton. Turned up all the way down, tipped in, so no icing against Binghamton behind in the hat trick's net. McDonald behind his own cage, turns it over, it's Turner behind the hat trick's net. Working it up to the far side, eight and a half gone in the third. Chipped up and out of play from Binghamton. Behind the hat trick's net. Faces off out to the neutral zone. 11.25 left in regulation. 3-2 Binghamton. Mealy, Bronner, and Noseworthy out for the Hattricks with Atwell and Pepe on the back end. And the Hattricks win it. Atwell will take over into his own end. Up the left wing for Noseworthy who dunks into the Hattricks offensive end. Mealy will chase in the corner. Noseworthy goes behind the net. Has the puck there. Coming out near side. Plays it all the way through the blue paint. It bounces out to Atwell who lets it fly. It goes wide of the net. Pepe at the point, dances around, looking to keep it in, does swat it to Bronner, and the hat tricks keep it alive in the offensive zone. Bronner, right circle, skating across down low, Noseworthy in his skates, has to turn around at the circle, plays it back toward the point. The shot tipped wide by Steve Mealy, and Binghamton will take over. 10.45 to go in the third. Black Bears play it all the way down, icing waved off. Hattricks down a goal, will take over in their own end. Atwell up to Steve Mealy, far wing. He is stopped by Yates in the neutral zone, and Yates will be stripped of the puck by Gesso. At the red line, Gesso skates left to right into the offensive end. Dunks into the corner, he'll stop along the wall and work the puck free behind the net. He's held up, has the puck back. Fitzgerald strips it and turns it away into the wall where Kirkby will play up. Kirkby right to left into the hat tricks and to Jurich off the far wall. Jurich has it swatted away from Lazaro into the corner. Gallagher lays a hit. Lazaro takes over. Chipping forward, not out of the zone. Powell keeps it in. Down low to Jurich. Under 10 to play in regulation. In the corner, hat tricks in. It's tipped up and off the stick out of play. And we'll step aside in Danbury. 3 2. Binghamton on top. 9.54 to go.
9.54 left in the third. 3-2, Binghamton on top. Faceoff will be in the hat trick zone, right circle for Dowda to take it as Wilson looks on. Three to two, Binghamton on top, they win the draw, the shot, they score! Jurich from the slot rips it over the glove of Wilson, right off the faceoff. It's 4-2, Binghamton leads, 9.49 left. Jurich gets his second of the night. And the hat tricks are down by two once again. Face off at center, one by Binghamton. Yates will take over. Right to left, it's Kirkby across the Hattrix line, deep into the Danbury end. Behind the net, Pepe will leave it for Atwell, turned up the wall and out to center. Chopped back ahead and past Atwell. Yates will skate in, the shot rises high over the bar and bounces off glass to the point. Fitzgerald shot in front, blocked by Ruiz, and the pass back to Ruiz in the neutral zone. He'll knock it in forward to the Binghamton end. Hattrick's forced to turn over there. Jesso works his way down low into the corner. And dances by, plays it back to the point. Pepe walking into the slot. The wrist shot goes through traffic, blocked down by Shepard and cleared to center. Pepe will play it off to the right wing. Jesso down low, right circle in front. Mealy tips it on goal, and Shepard makes another stop. He's made 29 tonight. Hattricks back in the their own zone. It is Gallagher up the far wing. Noseworthy has it with some space in the neutral zone. Skates across the offensive line, dances down low, cuts to the front of the net, chips it on goal. It's saved by Shepard in the corner. Bronner finds it out in front. Mealy one-timer, it's blocked and turned up and out by Binghamton. Back into the Hattricks end. Gallagher sidesteps a pair of Black Bears, the pass ahead out of the reach of Noseworthy, and he'll go off for a change. 8.05 to go in the third. Oganezov right to left across the Hattrick's line, speeds by right side, the backhand out in front, rebound, saved by Wilson, sliding across, and he stoned Sherman on the doorstep. The rebound went right to Sherman's stick. Wilson sprawled across to his right, makes the stop, and it's a big one for the Hattricks. 7.56 left, three, third period, 4-2, Binghamton on top. Hattricks win the face off in their own end, turned up the far wall, 7.50 left in the third and they take it out to center turned right back in Wilson leaves it to the side far wing it's tipped up and kept in by Turner Hattricks finally cleared a center seven and a half to go in regulation Hattricks down two have to step on it here late in the third Binghamton through center Oliver lays a hit and it's into the Hattricks end behind the net McDonald will take over on the left wing to Dowda Racing through center on the far wing across the Binghamton line. Shoots, it's blocked. Rebound to Tom Mealy. It's bouncing on him. He can't get it on his stick. He has it back on the pass. Back to Atwell, left side. Drives, and it's off the edge of the net. Out to Dowd on the near wing. Backhands down low for Kuznetsov. It's out of his reach. Turned up the wall. Atwell pinches in, keeps it alive, and the hat tricks are unable to keep it in. Atwell has to go back out to center, but Kuznetsov there to play it right back forward. Dowda sidesteps one into the offensive zone, looked for Tom Mealy on the wing, but couldn't get it there with 6.45 left. It's 4-2 Binghamton, and Yates carries through for the Black Bears. Right to left, into the hat-trick zone, stopped by Atwell. Pepe will take over across right side, Mangone, and into the zone, Ruiz. Left side, the wrist shot rising high and zipped in. Shepard makes the stop in his glove. 
6.31 left in the third, 4-2 Binghamton. Ruiz wins the faceoff. It's unable to win the faceoff. It's turned in, and Binghamton will look to carry out. Right to left, 6.20 to go. Tipped into the hat trick zone by the Black Bears and turned all the way up along behind by Wilson. Gallagher will step up far side into the neutral zone, banking it forward, not past Jurich. He'll ring it back into the hat trick zone. 6.05 to play in the third. Hat trick's down two. Lazaro from behind his own net, moving left to right for Danbury. Ahead to Mangone, speeding across to the right side and dumps in, chasing himself in the near corner. Offensive end, Hattricks with Mangone, taking it all the way around the far wing, and he overskates. It's played up by Binghamton and out to center. Yates will skate through, cross the red line and dump in. 5.40 to go, regulation. Hattricks down by two. Binghamton. Adding to their lead here in the third period. Jesso streaking in and the shot smothered by Shepard. It is a face-off in the Hattricks offensive zone. 4-2, Binghamton leads. 5.32 left in regulation. Steve Mealy on the far wing. Wins the face off across, Lugo takes it on the hash marks, twirling at the bottom of the ring, plays it down behind the net and Oganezov intercepts, turns up the wall, Oliver pinches in and it has a battle along the wall. One on two, Oliver works it free, Steve Mealy in the corner, working his way behind the net, coming out the far side, at the circle, feeds Bronner toward the front and stick was lifted, Oliver right circle will shoot in front, it's saved by Shepard. Rebound try from McDonald, far side, Shepard slides across to glove it. 5.05 left in the third. It's 4-2 Binghamton. Special welcome to the Phillips and Eglinton family reunion tonight. Phillips and Eglinton family reunion tonight. Far side down in the offensive zone will take. He wins it back. Pepe center point will walk across the line. Feeds Atwell left side. The shot through traffic. Tipped wide into the corner. Abbott there for Binghamton. Drops it behind his net. And Oganezov will fire up the far wing. Out at center, Atwell takes over and spins it back into the offensive zone. 4.45 to go, Hattrick's down two, late in the third. Oganezov up the far wing, gets to center and hits the linesman, the Hattricks take over. Tipped by Atwell and Newberg will carry into the Hattricks end. Right circle, the shot kicked away by Wilson all the way out to center and it comes to the neutral zone. Turner back in his own end for Binghamton, up through the neutral Ice and it is the Hattricks dumping back in. 4.20 to go in the third. Hattricks down two. Yarwood slowly makes his way behind his own net and will start up right to left. Banks it out to center. Ruiz intercepts and the Hattricks offside. He'll have to touch up. Puck trickles into the Binghamton end. They'll carry out. Yates across the Hattricks line. Gallagher sealed him off, but he gets the puck in front. Kirkby all along the backhand. He roofs it by Wilson. 3.58 left, and Kirkby found the puck all alone in the hat tricks end. He was able to put it over Wilson, and it is a 5-2 game. Billy McCreary on the hat tricks bench looks like he may call a timeout. He's got a whiteboard ready. And the Hattricks will call their timeout.
3.58 left in the third. 5-2. Binghamton on top, and the Hattricks just calling a timeout. They will pull the goalie with 3.50 to go and take it into the offensive zone. Dowda behind the Hattricks net. Extra attacker on for Danbury down three. 3.45 to go. Oliver slides it to Bronner. High slot, rips it wide of the net, and it comes out to McDonald on the far wing. Around the net for Mealy. It's past him and chipped all the way down toward the empty net. It bounces wide and icing called against Binghamton. 3.31 to go in the third period. 5-2. Binghamton leads and we'll be back for the final few minutes. Thirty-one left in regulation. Five-two Binghamton on top. The Hattricks will have an offensive zone face-off, and Brian Wilson on the bench. The extra attacker out for the Hattricks. Down three. Crucial points on the line for Danbury. The Hattricks win the draw, offensive end. Right circle, Gallagher down low. He can't keep it in at the point. It hops into the Binghamton bench. And the faceoff will stay in the Black Bears end. Ruiz, Mangone, Bronner, Gesso, Gallagher, Atwell out for the Hattricks. Extra skater on. Goalie pulled, 325 to go, down three. Ruiz. On the near circle, wins the puck back to Gallagher at the point. The shot through traffic, tipped wide, batted in front, they score! Ruiz swinging out of the air, puts it home, and it's a 5-3 game. 3.20 left in regulation. The captain gets his 47th. Three twenty left. The Hattricks get a quick goal, much needed, and it's a two-goal game with still enough time left for Danbury. Dowda at center ice will take the face off against Turner. He wins it back, and Atwell will skate it up the far wing, dumping into the offensive zone, and Wilson back to the bench. Extra skater back on for the Hattricks. Side of the net behind. It's clipped all the way down, and icing a penalty may be called. A whistle came up. And it will be a penalty on someone. Shepard went down behind the play. I don't think there's any call out of this. It was just a, a lot of nothing. The referee skated across to the scores table like he was making a call but and, and had a conversation with them. Let's we'll see if they make an announcement. Both teams still have five aside. The Hattricks have six with the goalie pull. Binghamton penalty box door has been opened. Nothing is on the board. 
And they'll close the door, 3.08 left. And it is Tracy who makes his way over. Everyone seemed confused as to what was going on. And the hat trick will go to the Ferrer Electric Power Play. 3.08 left in regulation. The hat tricks have the goalie pulled and a power play. It will be six on four for the hat tricks. The penalty was called on the goaltender, Shepard. So Tracy is serving. At least the board has 31 up on the board. Anyway, the Hattricks get a power play. Down by two, 3.08 to go. Extra attacker on, so it's six on four for the Hattricks. They win the faceoff into the corner. It's played up the wall. Gesso takes it along the half wall. It's cleared by Binghamton and all the way down. And the penalty means no icing against Binghamton for two minutes. 1.45 to go on the power play, 2.50 in regulation. Extra attacker for the Hattricks on the power play. Two-man advantage. Hattricks dump into the offensive zone. It takes a hop off the wall. Jesso fires wide, he misses the net, and it banks out to center. Mangone takes over in the neutral zone, skates into the offensive end, swings to the left circle. Has Jesso at the point and plays it to him along the blue line. Two and a half to go in regulation. 115 on the power play. Gallagher fires in on goal and Shepard covers up. 222 left in regulation. 114 on a hat trick's power play. They are down by two. Face off on the near circle. Dowda will take it against D'Angelo. Patrick with six skaters out. They win the face off. Pepe down low. It bounces away. Kuznetsov has it left circle. Dances by Steve Mealy. Center point to the right side. Tom Mealy on the circle along the boards. Feeds it toward the top of the slot. It's Dowda back to the point. Steve Mealy across Tom. 2.05 to go. One minute on the power play. Extra attacker on six on four for the hat tricks. Steve Mealy, center point, across far side, Kuznetsov, left circle, will rip it. It's saved by Shepard, the rebound into the corner. Kuznetsov back out in front, Bronner turns it wide to the net. 150 to go in regulation, it's turned out to center by Abbott. The Hattricks will have to take back over. 145 left in regulation, 36 on the power play. Steve Mealy into the offensive zone, six on four advantage for the Hattricks with the goalie pulled. Dowda keeps the clear in the shot, wide of the cage. It's Boilar who plays it all the way down, wide of the net. The Hattricks will have to go back for it. 90 seconds to go in regulation. Down two, 15 left on the power play. Tom Mealy across the line and to the left circle, fires across McDonald, plays it back in front, it's tipped away, and Yarwood will scoop it out. 1.14 to go in the regulation time. It is Mealy back into the offensive zone. Tracy out of the box, six on five for the Atrix. Kuznetsov rips it on goal, saved by Shepard, cleared all the way out, and racing for it is Tracy Atwell diving for it, and Kuznetsov as well. They play it behind the Atrix net. Atwell dumped in the corner, under a minute to play in the third. Hattricks need these points in the playoff race. It is turned up the wall, taken out the center by Sherman. Hattricks take over in the neutral zone. Ruiz into the offensive end. Extra attacker still on for the Hattricks, six on five, with 38 seconds left. Mangone across in the neutral zone. It's played from center by Binghamton off Lazaro into the Hattricks end. 30 seconds left. Gesso, back behind his own net, races up the ice. Extra attacker on for the Hattricks. Mangone into the offensive zone, across at the line. He's upended. Gallagher lays a hit. Binghamton comes with the puck. The outlet ahead to center. Lazaro with 15 seconds off to Gesso into the offensive zone. 10 seconds left. They'll play it wide of the net. It'll be an icing against Binghamton with a little bit over six seconds left. They'll add some time back to the clock here. 
7.9. Patrick's down too late. Dowda, far circle, offensive end. Wins the puck back, Gallagher will play across Ruiz, blast, saved by Shepard into the corner. Powell turns it all the way down, and that will do it. The hat tricks lose for the fourth, the fifth time at home all season. And it's a big one to the Black Bears. Danbury drops it 5-3. Joe Shepard makes 34 saves for the Black Bears and Danbury drops it. Five to three. The hat tricks back in action against Binghamton tomorrow night in Danbury Arena. Get your tickets at danburyhattricks.com and join us after the game. Skate with the players as the Hattricks will look for a big three points tomorrow night. Just got a little bit more important tomorrow with the loss. Tonight, the Hattricks and Black Bears have split the first two of the series. And we'll be back to finish it off tomorrow night. Thanks for tuning in from Danbury tonight. Josh Starr, happy as always to bring you the action as the regular season winds down. The Hattricks in the heat of the playoff race. We'll be back tomorrow night for the Hattricks and the Black Bears. Binghamton takes tonight. Five to three.